welcome back to another video and by the end of this video you will have a perfect trading plan for you so whoever is watching this wherever you are in the world by the end of this video you will have a perfect trading plan if you have a nine to five job so grab a notepad and pen and make notes during this video because we're basically going to be going through a trading plan and making it for you okay so you're going to be making the trading plan based on these things so copy these steps and by the end of the video you will have a personalized plan for you okay so let's get into it if you're not subscribed yet make sure to hit that subscribe button we're coming out with three videos per week you know i'm, I'm open to doing any kind of videos that you guys want me to do um so yeah let me know in the comments below if you have any video ideas and let's get into the video step one is to map out your full day so every single second of your day down to the 30 minutes so if you list out in 30 minute increments and then write down what you're doing at every single half an hour um, segment once you've done this find either in the morning or at night find one hour okay so find one hour in your day where you would be able to trade okay just one hour if you're saying to yourself i don't have time once you map this out you will find time trust me you will find time because there's going to be a time where it's maybe watch tv or watch netflix watch a film and i may maybe you could just extend your day instead of going to bed at nine go to bed at 10. if you're going to bed at 10 go to bed at 11. wake up at six instead of seven wake up at five instead of six there is always an answer to i don't have enough time i i don't have enough time is just an excuse find time and then we can move on to the next step so the next step is once you've found that one hour write it down so now that one hour is your trading time okay and that is going to be your trading time forever pretty much until you know life kind of changes it but you know you should have that for a long time so uh step number five is to pick one pick one currency pair okay only one currency pair i don't care what it is it can be anything just pick one currency pair i the kind of question that i kind of ask traders to get that answer is what is one currency pair that always draws you back so what what kind of currency pair is it that you can always rely on right which one is your currency pair that that you default to right what is the currency pair that you default to whatever that is that is now your currency pair so by now you've mapped out the time that you're going to trade and you've ma mapped out the currency pair that you're going to be trading it on step number six is to pick a random strategy literally pick a random strategy it does not matter it does not matter what current um what trading strategy you trade just pick one okay pick a random trading strategy it really does not matter trade pro on his youtube channel has loads of trading strategies pick one okay pick one you can literally close your eyes with your mouse hover over loads and just stop on a random one pick it trade it now you've got your strategy okay you've got the time that you're going to trade you've got the currency pair that you're going to trade now in that time you're now not going to be trading you're going to be back testing okay so step number eight is to back test in that one hour 300 or two years worth of data okay so in that one hour every single day now every single day for an hour you're going to be back testing so once you've finished the back testing you should now have either 300 trades or two years worth of data okay um, once you have this you now have your back testing data strategy currency pair and time to trade okay you see how we're kind of building this up um now take two screenshots of a long trade and take two screenshots of a short trade both of these need to be winners and in your opinion all four of these trades need to be perfect trades okay perfect trades take screenshots of these and actually annotate them so write down exactly why this is a perfect trade okay exactly why so by this stage you've got all of your data you've got your perfect trades everything is mapped out you should be comfortable 
with your trading plan right now. In my opinion, you are ready to trade live. Okay, I am not saying that you should be trading live because I can't tell you when to trade live. Um, I'm not advertising that you should be trading live. But if you feel like you are ready to trade live, which by this stage you should be, then if you fail in terms of trading live, it is not the strategy. Let me say that again. If you fail to be profitable, it is not the strategy. It is you. Okay. You've done all of the work needed to be a profitable trader. All you need to do is trade it. All you need to do is trade it. So stop going from video to video to try and find the perfect strategy when it fails. Right? It's not the strategy anymore. If you fail, it is you. <laughs> I don't know how much I can kind of say this before I get repetitive and and more and more aggressive. But um you know, if if you fail to be profitable, it is you, not the strategy. And the last step, step 10, is to hit the like button, comment below if you've made it to this part of the video because a lot, a lot of traders would not have made it this far, okay? A lot of traders would have not made it this far. They would have got bored, right? So congratulations to making it this far in the video. Comment below if you did and I will be replying to every single comment um i hope you have an amazing time with your trading best of luck with your trading strategy and let me know how the trading goes after kind of three and six months it'll be amazing to hear from you best of luck and i will see you in the next video